Welcome to Review Central. This is DOST reviewer number one, featuring questions on verbal reasoning. This reviewer is intended for those who are eyeing, or are set to take, the DOST scholarship qualifying exam. There are 10 questions featured on this reviewer. All questions are modeled on actual questions that appeared on previous DOST qualifying exams. Before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to Review Central and click or press the bell button to make sure you get notified whenever we post a new reviewer or other review materials on this channel. Now let's begin. Verbal reasoning number one. Do as to did, in the same manner that, cost is to. A. Costed. B. Cost. C. Coasted. D. Coast. The correct answer is B. Cost. The relationship between the first pair of words is, present tense to past tense. The past tense of do is did. The past tense of cost is also cost. Verbal reasoning number two. Whale is to pod, in the same manner that, kitten is to. A. Heard. B. Kindle. C. Pride. D. Pack. The correct answer is B. Kindle. The relationship between the first pair of words is, animal is to collective name. A pod is the most common name for a group of whales, but other names include a gam, a herd, and a plump of whales. A group of kitten is known as a kindle, although a group of kittens born to the same mother is called a litter. In general, a group of cats, regardless of age, is called a clutter or a chowder. Verbal reasoning number three. Hide is to conceal, in the same manner that, stop is to. A. Halt. B. Pause. C. Reflect. D. Ponder. The correct answer is A. Halt. The relationship between the first pair of words is, their synonyms. Hide is synonymous with conceal. So we should be looking for the synonym of stop, which is halt. Verbal reasoning number four. Albert Einstein is to law of gravity, in the same manner that, Alexander Fleming is to. A. Telephone. B. Sonogram. C. Monograph. D. Penicillin. The correct answer is D. Penicillin. Albert Einstein is best known for his general theory of relativity, which explains gravity as a distortion of space, or more precisely, spacetime, caused by the presence of matter or energy. It is also often referred to as the law of gravity. On the other hand, Alexander Fleming is best known for discovering penicillin. This discovery led to the introduction of antibiotics that greatly reduced the number of deaths from infection. Verbal reasoning number five. Big is to enormous, in the same manner that, small is to. A. Parasitic. B. Minuscule. C. Macroscopic. D. Voluminous. The correct answer is B. Minuscule. The relationship of the first pair of words is that they are synonyms. More specifically, enormous is another, more descriptive way to describe something that is really big. Therefore we are looking for a synonym for small, and a more descriptive way to describe something that is really small. Among the choices, only minuscule fits the criteria. Parasitic has nothing to do with size. Voluminous is actually the opposite of small. Microscopic might have been a possible answer but macroscopic is its opposite. Verbal reasoning number 6. Sarah is to TBSBI, in the same manner that, Palma is to, a. SBSSC. B. NBOJBO. C. RIFJMBO. D. QBMNB. The correct answer is D. The relationship between the first pair of words, or group of letters, is that each letter of the first word is adjusted one step forward to make the second. That is, S becomes T, A becomes B, R becomes S, and H becomes I. Applying the same rule on the second pair. P should become Q, A should become B, L should become M, and M should become N. Verbal reasoning number 7. Galileo Galilei is to telescope, in the same manner that, Benjamin Franklin is to A. Electricity B. Motion picture camera 
C. Telegraph wire D. Steam engine The correct answer is A. Electricity While Galileo did not invent the telescope, he did design and build telescopes with increasingly higher magnifying power for his own use and to present to his patrons. He was the first to report telescopic observations of the mountains on the moon, the moons of Jupiter, the phases of Venus, and the rings of Saturn. The telescope eventually became most associated with him. On the other hand, although Benjamin Franklin did not discover electricity, his experiments relating to lightning and electricity made him the name most associated with electricity. He published an idea for an experiment using a lightning rod to try and catch an electrical charge in a Leiden jar, a storage container for electrical charges, thus demonstrating that lightning was a form of electricity. Verbal reasoning number 8. Bat is to ball, in the same manner that, bow is to, a. Tie B. Strength C. Bong D. Arrow The correct answer is D. Arrow With the use of a bat, a ball can be made to travel fast and far. The same with a bow and arrow. With the use of a bow, an arrow is made to travel fast and far. Verbal reasoning number 9. Bowed strings is to violin, in the same manner that woodwind is to a. Horn B. Piano C. Flute D. Guitar The correct answer is C. Flute. Bowed string instruments are mostly used in a classical symphony orchestra. These instruments are the violin, viola, cello and double bass. Woodwind is any of a group of wind musical instruments, composed of the flutes and reed pipes, that is, clarinet, oboe, bassoon, and saxophone. Both groups were traditionally made of wood, thus the name woodwind, but now they may also be constructed of metal. <music> Verbal reasoning number 10. Sponge is to porous, in the same manner that, skunk is to A. Shiny B. Smelly C. Nocturnal D. Carnivorous The correct answer is B. Smelly the main characteristic of a sponge is its being porous. A skunk, on the other hand, is infamous for its stinky odor. The reason skunks smell bad is because of a gland under their tail that produces and sprays their stink as a form of defense mechanism. You have just completed DOST Reviewer number 1, which featured questions on verbal reasoning. If you wish to watch more DOST reviewers on verbal reasoning, check out our Dust Verbal Reasoning playlist. Check out also our other DOST playlists for other reviewer topics. If you haven't done so yet, please don't forget to subscribe to Review Central and click or press the bell button to make sure you get notified whenever we post a new reviewer or other review materials on this channel. Please like if you find this video useful and feel free to share to anyone who may also benefit from it. We wish you all the best on your forthcoming DOST scholarship qualifying exam.